going like uh, oh welcome everybody so i am celebrating my 100th upload to youtube woohoo 100 videos my time does fly so as a celebration i am going to show you how to build a beautiful top end computer here we go we have got a uh what is that thing it's a like a h81m blah 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 motherboard yep good on it whatever uh we've got a uh, a ryzen 7 beautiful we've got some uh 16 gigabytes of ram uh we've got a 650 watt power supply okay so so some of the things you're going to need in a in a build here is um you're going to need a kitchen knife so you can do up the screws you're going to need some different types of pliers uh that's going to be the hang on to sh you're going to need you're going to need some assorted hammers you're going to need some cork screws and you'll need a die grinder and you'll need some thermal paste money oh so the first thing we want to do is we want to chuck in our ram we've got our uh, 16 gigabytes here of uh, 3200 and uh, because the ram is blue then it's got to go in one of the blue ones here you see so we'll go and put it in there and um get it in okay come on come on go in Let's get rid of this soft bit underneath there so we can put it. What's going on? Uh -huh. See, look at that. You've got a bit of a gap there, right? And you've got a little posty thing there, right? And that's stopping that from going in there. <laughs> uh, so, what you've got to do, mark that like that. See that? We just put a little mark on there like such. Okay, now grab your Dremel, put this away so you don't get all through it, very important, alright, and then just, there you go, look at that, and it's got the, <laughs> oh, that stinks, see, and it's got the little lines there to follow. Okay, so always always follow your little lines. Okay, so that goes in there like such. Come on. Aha! There you go, see? Beautiful. Right, click that. There we go, click that down. Great, right, now, open your little CPU tray thing here, right? Overclocking, right? You always want to overclock your stuff, so this is what you do, right? That um, that little triangle bit there, right, is supposed to go on that little triangle bit there, right? But to overclock it, you pretend that this is a clock, right? And so you overclock it like that, you see? You just turn it around. Now, I want to overclock mine two times, so that's what I do. I wind it around two times, okay? So you got your little little arrows facing there right and you go one and then two right and that'll get you to overclock it like that right now what we do is we put that down in there like that and here we go look it's a it's a little tight okay that's only because it's brand new all right stuff is always tight now grab yourself a nylon mallet right and, or a rubber one don't go using a steel hammer, okay? This is f***ing really good technology. It's top of state of the art. I've had people email me all the time going, Jim, why does my bloody computer don't work? I said, so where'd you put your CPU in with? They said, a f***ing hammer. I said, what kind of hammer? Or a claw hammer? You idiot. You, you're supposed to use the proper f***ing tools for this job, right? So just, just a light, a light tap. There you go. Look. Beautiful. Absolutely fantastic. Right. Now, uh, we could have, we could have used the, uh, you know, if, you, if you're short on money, you know, you could use your, 
the the cooler that comes with the with the with your CPU if you if you bought like a, a Ryzen 7 or whatever the hell like this one um, she is there well, if you if you bought one of those you could you could use that like that but um, I'm gonna use a aftermarket cooler and I'm gonna put two fans on there and I'm gonna do them so they both blow right now what the go is, is I put one fan so it blows that way another fan so it blows that way and they meet in the middle and then they blow out the edges out there you see and you get twice the amount of cooling okay so those go on those things there but before you do that right you've got to use some thermal paste now i like to buy my thermal paste in bulk um this was only um 32 dollars for this and they wanted to charge me uh like for 0 0.5 mils of arctic blue or whatever they wanted to charge me like in 27 dollars of that for a joke no way so the idea behind your thermal paste is you need, you need a decent amount you want to you want to cover your cpu enough okay so just you know make sure you got a bit on there That's, that's starting to look pretty good. Just... Right, that should... See, that's spread now. That's almost covering it now. Okay? It's just... We need a decent amount because we have overclocked it by two times. So... Oh, I think that... Oh, just a little bit more just in case. Just to be, just to be safe. Right. <clears throat> now... We're also going to put some on this one as well. Okay, so... Oh, jeez, that fucking shit stiff. Come on. And you go. Just... Not too much. Just enough. All right? Okay, that'll be... I think that's... No, let's just make sure. Righto. Okay. Good stuff. Right. Now, put that over there. And... These clippy things here. So, should I put that one on first? I'll bring this one over now. And push that bit down like that. Come on. Ah, look, there you go. Beautiful. Absolutely fantastic. Right, good stuff. Okay, so next we're going to chock on our 2060 Ti uh, that goes like like such I can't believe I got such a bargain with this <laughs> mate that guy's gonna be spewing come on just you know be gentle with these There you go. Beautiful. Fantastic. Right. Um, oh, I forgot to show you my monitor. Check that out. Look. It's my uh, 4K monitor there. A 32 inch at uh, 200 and something hertz. 260, 220. I don't know. I forget what the f it is. Fucking expensive though, I tell you. Very, very, very expensive. But anyway, all good. It was worth it. Mate, this thing is going to kick some serious ass. You watch. I'll, I'll benchmark this at the end of this. And, <laughs> mate, I'll tell you what. Linus, Kyle, uh, Steve, uh, Jay, ignore them. They're, they're posers. They've got no idea what they're doing, right? You you want to get somebody like me, I'm an expert, okay? I'm a, I'm a more than an expert. I'm, I'm the best of 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 the best yeah and then you've got this one here all right and that one goes in here like like ah like such mm, okay so the mm, what the f wrong with this thing why might that go in there 
it's just a bit tight that's all yep yeah it's just a bit tight okay so just just give it a light tap there you go see perfect there's nothing wrong with that beautiful and I'll just zoom on in there so you can have a good look <coughs> see oh, fits oh where are we oh camera's gone see there you go look fits perfectly nothing wrong with that at all beautiful you notice we haven't got any uh, buttons or anything to be able to turn this on and test it right so what you do is get yourself your kitchen knife right and you just got to short out these little things here all right and if you short out all of those like this okay but when the power supply is on then it'll start up and and, and go for it I'll zoom right in here so you can see this we've got the power supply and everything switched on we've got the monitor on and um it should just uh, boot straight up so all righty here we go okay get it going like uh, oh Grab me that can, that can, what? the, the WD-40, grab me the WD-40, go oh, hell, oh no, no, oh shit, no, oh, god damn it, turn the camera off, turn, turn the camera off, because people will think I'm a fucking idiot, that's why, oh shit, damn it, Beautiful monitor. <laughs> Ow, that's hot. There must be a fault in that motherboard. Ah, oh, unreal. You know what? You Linus. I wonder if I can tell them that shit happened in ship.